Ngineko ni kwamba makaburi ya halaiki yanayoaminika kuwa ya Waafrika waliofariki katika vita vya kwanza vya dunia yamegunduliwa leo katika eneo la Kariako kiungani mwa Voi hiyo ni kaunti ya Taita Taveta Frida. Na kugunduliwa kwa eneo hilo lilo katika mita chache kutoka eneo lilokuwa kambi ya wanajeshi wa Uingereza <coughs> kuna tarajiwa kujibu maswali chungu nzima kuhusu walikozikwa mashujaa wa Afrika kutokana na vita vya kwanza vya dunia. Mwana habari wetu ukanda huo Billy Otieno alizuru eneo hilo na akanda taarifa hii. Mabaki ya miili ya watu wanaoaminika kuwa Waafrika walioshiriki vita vya kwanza vya dunia imegunduliwa takriban mita moja kutoka sehemu iliyokuwa kambi ya wanajeshi wa Uingereza. Kugunduliwa kwa makaburi hayo kunategua fumbo la jadi ni wapi miili ya Waafrika waliofariki katika vita hivyo ilizikwa. Hatua tofauti zimefanywa na wanahistoria ili kuweka kumbukumbu ya mashujaa wa Afrika. Sherehe za kumbukumbu ya mashujaa wa Uingereza waliofariki katika vita hivyo zimekuwa zikiandaliwa katika nchi za jumuiya ya madola. As the construction was going on uh, during the foundation, they happened to find bones and as they dug deeper they found more and more bones, chain, uh, brass chains and so on and so forth. This will be an equivalent to the discovery in Old Vigoz, uh, the cradle of mankind. This will be the cradle of World War One, because uh, we keep on talking about Africans. We've talked about Africans, but there's nowhere where we found actually indication of African graves and what have you. Many a times we had this question: Where were the Africans? If they were soldiers, or whether they were slaves, where were they buried? And uh, we are glad if it's going to be authenticated and it's going to be true then this is a major breakthrough and a discovery. Some, some would say some estimates are as high as one million people from Kenya alone participated in the First World War uh, and they would have done that principally in two ways, either through being a, an Askari, uh, a conscripted member of the British Army, or they would have also been uh, a carrier and they would have been porters to help resupply and to move the troops. Hatua itakayochukuliwa na idara hudma ya makavazi nchini kufuatia uvumbuzi huo huenda ikageuza mkondo wa historia na sherehe za kumbukumbu za vita za kwanza zinazosherekewa katika nchi za jumuiya ya madola kila mwaka. Bilo Tieno, NTV katika kaunti ya Taita Taveta.